I do CSGO trade-ups for a living and have made more than $6,000 just in 2023 while running this channel and studying in you. When 3 years ago, I was dirt poor and could only afford a few dollars of skins. Now, I know most of you guys are just starting out and only have a low starting budget, so in this video, I will share you a $1 trade-up which will make you hundreds of dollars. To start, all you have to do is set up a buyer tier for 15 cents on these 5 skins on the field tested condition. Now, the skins that you'll get from these buyer tiers will have a float between 0.15 and 0.38, and I'll separate these skins into 8 different scenarios depending on what float you get. So the first scenario is if you get skins with floats between 0.15 and 0.195 and just plug them all in a trade-up contract. And it will turn out to be an insanely profitable trade-up. So you will get $1.40 profit with the M4A1, then a dollar profit with the MAC-10, the Glock, and the P90, and only a $0.40 cents toss with the revolver. And the profitability of this trade-up is literally 171% and 150% after Steam tax, so it is quite insane. By the way, I'll be giving away this M4A4 in the pin comment down below. Now the next scenario is if you get skins with floats between 0.195 and 0.203 and this is now the trade-up that we will be doing. So we will be seeing 9 field tested revolution skins and 1 minimal wire revolution skin. Now to get the minimal wire revolution skin, all you have to do is make sure to download the CSGO float market checker extension. I will link it down below in the description box. And now all you have to do is go to the Steam community market, then choose CSGO and then show advanced options, choose revolution skins, then minimal wire, normal and mill spec and it will show you all of the minimal or revolution skin. Now open all of these in a new tab and just snipe a skin with a float below 0.09. Now as an additional tip for you guys, you can use minimal wear danger zone skins instead of minimal wear revolution skins and it will make the trade up much cheaper and make the floats much easier to get. So that is really nice. Now going back, all you have to do is plug in the trade up and if you used minimal wear danger zone skins, here are the outcomes. It will be very profitable but it is quite complicated so I'll just stick with minimal wear revolution skins and here are the outcomes. As you can see, it is still insanely profitable with a profitability of 137% after Steam tax. Now the third scenario is if you get skins with floats between 0.203 and 0.22 and here is the trade-up. Basically we use 8 field tested revolution skins and 2 minimal wear revolution or danger zone skins. So it will make the trade-up a little bit more expensive but it is still only $1 and it is still very profitable with a profitability of 125.84% which is really nice. Now let's hear a quick word from sponsor of this video. Do you want to trade the old ugly skins you don't use for the newer better skins? Well the steam market takes a hefty tax so a better way to do this will be using the sponsor of this video Skins Monkey. Skins Monkey has a huge inventory so any skin you want is in here and I even get my low float skins for my trade ups in here. So all you have to do in the side is put in the skins that you don't want then put in the skins you want and click trade. And by using my code Dalsu you can get a free $5 or a 35% bonus if you top up. And if you don't have any skins, Skins Monkey has a lot of giveaways which you can enter so make sure to check it out. Link is in the description. Now the next scenario for skins between 0.22 and 0.24, just do a 7-3 split between field tested and minimal wear skins. And it will still be a very profitable trade-up. Next scenario for skins between 0.24 and 0.255, just plug them all in in a trade-up. Now the M4A1 and the Glock will now come out in the field tested condition, but it will still be a very profitable trade-up as you can see over here. Now for the 6th scenario, for skins with floats between 0.255 and 0.28, here is the trade up. So we will be using 9 field tested revolution skins and 1 minimal wear skin. And it will just be the last trade up but a little bit more expensive so the profitability will go down a bit but it's still quite profitable. Now for the next scenario, if you get skins between 0.28 and 0.305, just plug them all in in a trade up and it will come out to be this trade up. So it will be a break even trade up now but these are skins with bad floats so we'll take a break even instead of selling them in the steam market with a 13% steam tax. Now the last scenario is if you get skins with floats higher than 0.305. Now unfortunately you will have to sell these off in the steam market and you can sell them off in the steam market for 17 cents and that will give you a break even after steam tax but this will take a really long time and so what I recommend is just sell them off for 16 cents each and take the 1 cent loss cause this trade up is really worth it. Now one tip for using buy orders, make sure to set up only 1 to 3 items at the time and just set up the buy order again after it gets filled out. This is because if you set up 20 buy orders at once, you could get fucked by someone also doing this trade up and selling off their bad float skins for the highest buy order price, which in this case is you. Now I'll just set up some buy orders and see how much profit I can get in one day. So after a day and a half of setting up buy orders, we got around 240 skins which we can use for trade ups. And let me just speedrun these trade ups for you guys. WWWL, WWWL, WWWL. 
So after computing the profits and losses, we got a profit of $13.20 after Steam Tax from those 24 trade ups. And we lost around 80 cents to Steam Tax after selling off the bad float skins. So we got $12.40, which is more than the minimum wage in my country. And I don't know if I should feel glad or feel sad. But since we did these trade ups in one day, you could literally get up to $86 in one week. But congratulations, you have now learned a very good CSGO trade up. But if you want to take the next level and know how to 30 times your money with trade ups, make sure to click on this video.